Okay, hello and welcome to another unboxing for makingmusic.com. Uh, today we are having a look at this uh, Studio Spares S300 ribbon microphone. Um, own brand uh, from a well known retailer in the UK. Um, bit of a different one for me. Um, you know, I've got um, several different types. Um, of capacitor mics and dynamic mics for the studio um, but I fancied uh, a ribbon microphone as well um, just because of the, um, the different kind of tones slightly smoother top end that it um, can generally have over capacitor microphones um, and obviously same as most things you get what you pay for this is much more down the budget end of the market um, really expensive ribbon microphones are very very good um, but I thought uh, the Studio Spares S300, uh, quite cheap price in, in, on the, in the main, but they had it for sale, so I thought I'd take a bit of a punt, um, and uh, this is what you get. So, what's in the box? Uh, it's a fairly well-packed box, it's quite weighty. So, in the box, there is another box. Some kind of instructions about how to plug your microphone in. Seems to be a rubber widget kind of thing there. And then what I presume is the main event because it is a very large wooden box, which is not something I expected to see for something that is a uh, budget article um, makes it look quite makes it makes it look expensive it's quite a well made box latches hinges kind of things you expect on a on a box so first off in the smaller box we've got mic stand widgets I'm sure we all have many of and then the actual mic holder, uh, it's quite well made, it's quite cold so there must be some metal in there, elastic um, shock mount, kind of standard kind of thing that you get with, actually you get with, with expensive microphones, don't know whether it's a standard thing with cheap microphones, uh, there is a kind of, I don't know if you can see that, there is a, a threaded um, screw, thumb screw kind of thing there which I suspect tightens the shock mount around the microphone just to hold it quite sturdy. It's quite heavy so it should be quite good for isolating. And then the box and the mic itself. Well that's very plush. It's quite well padded. Ribbon microphones can be damaged quite easily especially if they're dropped. Nice royal blue velveteen holding bag. And then the mic itself, standard silica gel. Don't feed that to your kids or animals. And there is the mic. Again, it's quite heavy, so quite similar to the shock mount. to be mounted in so it's quite a weight which um, is a good sign even for a budget microphone. Um, it's quite well made. Yeah, ribbon microphone. Let's just see if we can try it in there. I will say that the um, box suggests that this mic is ready for phantom power. Um, which is not something that you normally see in regards to ribbon microphones um, but it does have um, a pre-amplifier on board to uh, amplify the output signal so I would suggest that that is what the phantom power does um, but there we have the mic and its shot mount which will tighten the screw yes, it feels quite 
quite a good sturdy, it's very snug fit definitely, it definitely feels like that um, it's not going to fall out. Uh, obviously like I said before the widget, change that to UK mic stand mount. So there we go. Now it does say on the again on the packaging that the ribbons are easily changeable, but I don't see that there is any spare ribbons included. I don't want to take that part. I don't think that goes any further than that. It does appear to be quite well stuck down. Let's see if the mic goes back in nice and snugly. Yes, yeah, so um, needing to buy uh, another ribbon for it might be uh, elusive. And it's also a pity that there's nowhere in the box for the shock mount to be housed. That has to come along separately. Could have had an extra bit on the side of the box maybe, I don't know. Um, so there you go. The Studio Spares S300 ribbon microphone forward to plugging that in and hearing what it sounds like but we shall leave that for another video.